Hi Cyberland, welcome to Warsaw Railway Station. Now Warsaw Station is sited between Birmingham and Rugeley on the Chase Line. But the reason about Warsaw Railway Station today is because I'm waiting for the 11 o'clock West Midlands Railway Service to take me to a railway station that only reopened on the 29th of May 2022. It was shut for one year because they were doing some work to the railway stations and trains weren't stopping at this railway station. The railway station what about is Perry Bar Station because he just had a £30 million investment to overhaul it ready for the Commonwealth Games in July and August. So we're going to take a look at Perry Bar Railway Station. Now before I take my train, I don't like to be negative on this channel, but unfortunately when I looked at the photos online yesterday, I did see that Perry Bar Station, I had mixed feelings about it. So we are going to take a look at the railway station and see if the £30 million investment was worth it. So I'm going to wait for a train to arrive now to board it and take it to Pay Bar Station. The next stop will be Perry Bar. I'll be honest with you, it really does look different standing on the platform at Perry Bar Railway Station. I actually took some photos before they closed the station back in April 2021, which I'm going to be showing you now how the entrance to the station used to look like, the corridor that took you onto the platforms, how narrow it was, and it was very different before they knocked it down and rebuilt the station building and sorted the platforms out as well. But Perry Bar Railway Station is also actually the station on its original site, the longest service station in the Birmingham area, because this station opened on the 4th of July 1837 by the Grand Junction Railway. There's just one thing at Perry Bar Railway Station that's just making me laugh at the moment, and that is that up there. That's basically to tell people to stand clear for the platform edge because trains do pass through here, but they just stuck it onto the station sign. Platform 2 for the 1140 West Midlands Railway Service to Walsall. So while at Pay Bar Railway Station, we're actually joined by someone else. You can pop out now. And that was something completely different. Hello, everybody. Yes, Tico Sprint is here with us. Hello. Hi. How are you today? I am very good. How are you, sir? I'm all right, thank you. Good. Are we going to have a look at Pay Bar? Indeed we are. To be honest, we are indeed. Indeed we are, to be honest. Let the chaos begin. Platform 1 for the 12.13 So at the end of Pay Bar Railway Station, you're looking towards Hampstead, they've got these refuge points here. Now these refuge points are here just in case any emergencies happen at the railway station. It's also got a little speaker here as well. So we're now on platform two at Pay Bar Station. They actually have waiting shelters on both platforms here, on platform one and platform two, which Tico's just demonstrated sitting down in the waiting shelter. Pay Bar's also got help points on each platform. Also, the station does have dot matrix boards, but they don't really look like the dot matrix ones because the information boards here are so clear, you can actually see them on your phone. Also, there's plenty of benches at Pay Bar Railway Station as well for you to sit down. The station also has litter bins here as well, and it looks like it has been well used for the past two days of rubbish. What's in the bin? What's in the bin? Rubbish. Yes. So at the old station at Pay Bar, there actually used to be a ramp here which took wheelchair users and people with push chairs and bikes out of the station. However though, that has long since gone, I'll explain that one in a second. However though, on platform one, the ramp to the exit is still here, but it's behind this gate here. I reckon they're going to use this exit possibility to send passengers to or from the Alexander Stadium for the games. So I reckon it could be used as additional 
exit or entrance to the station on busy days. So the reason that pay bar has got the ramps removed is because it's now got lift access here. So we're going to take a quick trip in the lift. Now unfortunately before we do, actually I uh, want to show you that here, there's a crack in the lift already. Oh. What was that then? <laughs> anyway, let's get in the lift. Oh. So the lift, I'll be honest with you, it really has that new smell to it, uh, concourse level. It really has this new smell, the lift. But the old pay bar station never had the lifts before. So this is something new at pay bar railway station, especially with disabled access passengers in wheelchairs and push chairs instead of using the steps. Now the exit is actually on this side right here. So we'll just wait for the doors open. Concourse level. And then we're in the concourse at Pay Bar Railway Station. I'll tell you what, this concourse is very spacious indeed. And also at Pay Bar Station as well, it's actually got a footbridge just down here so you can get onto the other platform through the footbridge without going through the concourse as well. So we're out of the concourse at Pay Bar Station and honestly it's very spacious around here. Really, really spacious. Like you have the old entrance onto the platform and now that passageway was and this is just so wider and better than the original station building here also uh, we've got disabled access toilets just here so it does have toilet facilities we look this way it's just still spacious we're just going to have a look at some of the way the ticket machines are and the ticket office as well so on this side of the concourse at pay bar station you've got your baby change facilities just here also, again, you have to seek assistance if you want to use them. Just up here is a lovely information board just here, telling you where the trains are, go heading towards Warsaw, Birmingham, Wolverhampton. Just over here are the ticket machines. There's about two ticket machines here. There is also a ticket office here as well, which is closed, but... So even though that ticket office there is closed, you just look around the corner here, there is another ticket office here. So it does have two ticket offices and this one's open. They are open at 7 in the morning till 6 in the evening. And also, that takes you down towards Platform 1, that does. Now I'm going to put a comparison on screen of the old pay bar entrance to platforms and the current one, which is just right behind me here. So according to some signage, pay bar station actually has 33 steps. And that's what we're going to be doing now. We're going to be counting the steps going down to Platform pay bar station. One, two, three, four, five, six. Also want to say that this concourse at Pay Bar Station is also very airy and very spacious as well. It's well lit as well. Is it Tico? It is. So we just come outside of Pay Bar Railway Station. The old entrance to the station was just literally on this street right here. It's just there. Yeah. But honestly, looking at the new station building just up here, it's a bit controversial I would say because honestly, the thing up here is supposed to be orange. But it just has that like rusty feeling towards it, does it? It does. Yeah, it feels like it's supposed to be new. Doesn't well, it feel like it? Doesn't it feel like it effect, do, yeah. Right. I don't know if the rusty effect's there on purpose or it's just there by accident, but it's one thing that I don't like about the station building. And there's a fire alarm that's just hey. gone off for some strange reason. So we're still outside Pay Bar Railway Station where the ticket office is just right there. Also at this station, there's actually another ticket machine just there, so there's actually three ticket machines at Pay Bar Railway Station. And the fire alarm has just gone off again because they're doing a fire alarm test. But also here, there's a lovely little seating area just here as well, where you can sit here, relax, while you're waiting for your train. So also outside Pay Bar Railway Station, you actually do have cycle storage here as well, which you can park your bikes here, then board the train if you don't want to take your bike with you. And also across the street here, is the one-stop shopping centre as well. Also, if you come out of this exit at Pay Bar Railway Station here, it does have some more benches over here as well, so you can have more seating space, so you can sit down and wait for your train here as well. 
And that is basically a quick look around Pay Bar Railway Station. Honestly, I did say at the start of the video, it's a bit mixed feelings about it, but look at it in person. It's really changed my mind. The platforms do look good, apart from the one or two things I did point out. But the station building itself is absolutely brilliant. Very spacious, very well lit, and honestly, it's worth the £30 million investment. And when the Commonwealth Games come to pay by in 2022, it's going to be at its full potential. And honestly, when the Commonwealth Games come on, I'm actually not going to be in Birmingham. I'm going to be well away from Birmingham during that time. Special thanks to Tico Sprinter here, to have, who had a look around with me. Always a pleasure, Simon. Do you want to plug your channel? Tico Sprinter, if you want something completely different and a complete lunatic who likes your sprinters, you've come to the right channel. And Chaos as well. Indeed. Please do go check his channel out. He does like Tracy World stuff. Subscribe to Cyber. Yeah. Tracy World stuff. Um, Train Simulator. Train Simulator. Train Spotting. Later, train train spotting. spotting Teak Adventures, reviewing stations and stuff and lines, reviewing stations and trains, Train Simulator. Uh, tradesable to live streams, quick Q&A. All of that, yeah. So, yes, do go subscribe to Tico Sprinter. And also, feel free to subscribe to this channel, give it a thumbs up. And, honestly, it has really been a good look at Pay Bar Railway Station. Thank you for watching, stay safe. Bye for now. Don't get the last word.